Many central Texas cities are in drought conditions. A Houston company wants to pump more than 2 million gallons of water a day out of the ground in Hayes County. Property owners in that area say they thought they had already beat the same company three years ago in the Texas legislature, but they were wrong. Keck Sandsville praised and went to Hayes County to see what's going on. This is what we live off of, so we take care of it. It's like a little fortress in here. Generations of Chris Elliott pumps water from the well yeah. on his property outside of Wimberley. The water from the Trinity Aquifer allows him to live here with his wife and to grow his food from a garden. I got good water now, but I have no guarantees what kind of water I'm going to get after this. Mm -hmm. The thing is, the Houston-based company Electro Purification bought the rights to wells right next to his land. They want to pump more than two million gallons a day to go forth special utilities district for future development in the area. It would take water from under the Elliots. I reached out to both Electro Purification and Go Forth SUD for an interview. They have not yet returned a phone call. Workers for the Barton Springs Edwards Aquifer Conservation District recommend approving a permit that starts at half a million gallons a day, then goes up if certain conditions are met. The Elliots say if approved, they'll have to dig a deeper well, costing tens of thousands of dollars. Oh if, my golly, yeah, you're not kidding. It's a huge loss yeah. for, uh, so for one company to make some money. And many of their neighbors, they say, will simply have to move out. What you do is you're going to get up every single day, and you're going to go to your tap, and you're going to hope the water's there. Outside of Wimberley, Phil Prazen, KXAN News. During the public comment period, the Barton Springs Edwards Aquifer Conservation District received several requests to contest the claim, and their board will meet on July 12th to decide whether to hold a hearing or send it to the state for arbitration. This has all happened before, rather recently. A few years ago, electro purification wanted to pump 5 million gallons a day out of the area wells. At the time, that district wasn't part of any conservation district, so neighbors had no say. But in 2015, the representative in the area, Jason Isaac, filed a bill to lump the area into the Barton Springs Edwards Aquifer Conservation District. That bill passed into law, and now the conservation district gets the final say.